And it's <laughs> not gonna lie, it's been a while. <laughs> Since I, I've kind of been neglecting my dailies even quite a bit recently. So this is probably gonna be my first time I'm gonna be doing my daily in in a few days. I, you know, I always I kind of low key hate the free pools. I low-key hate the free pools because they're not really free pools. They're like, if it was the same value as a regular pool, then yeah, like they would actually be pretty, pretty cool. But it, they're not. They don't guarantee anything or don't have the chance to get something. Uh, or let me say, there's no like featured like metal form or anything. It's just... You're just giving random medals across the entire pool and there's like what over six or seven hundred medals in the game like pfft, good luck uh, i love this soundtrack so much yeah. i've been trying to re-roll these pet traits on for my pet uh yeah these pet traits on my on my copy metals for the longest time now i still only have like two or three copy metals at this point that have uh extra attack or the 120 percent extra attack hey what's up ansem how are you doing from my... i'm doing good how about you man i'm kind of I'm kind of getting back into Union Cross. Been <laughs> okay. I really did. Be, I don't know if you ever watched my uh, my video last, like a, what was it, yesterday or the day before. But I, I'm pretty much more or less gonna start becoming just just a casual player at this point. Um, I'll complete whatever I can, but it's like if I can't complete something, it's like it's not it's not a big deal for me. It's like, oh, okay, I can't complete it. I'll do my best, but no guarantees. Uh, oh, I, only, I have 10. Oh, I have 10. It's not really much. Why is this worth so much? Twelve trait medals? Jesus Christ, no wonder. And attack boost 9 max. Okay. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Alright. We get started on, uh... On my dailies. I haven't done dailies in this game for... Quite a few days. I haven't gotten any new metal from the from these I don't remember what my last newest metal was like my last good metal was probably like these guys <laughs> probably I don't think I don't think I've ever gotten uh, any of the newest tier 9 medals at all period lately I've started becoming a lot less uh, indifferent about pulls lately too, because like so all the medals are honestly, they they're not they're not a big deal. They're, they're not the greatest, or they're either specifically for PvP. And I'm just at the point where I don't even need to really do PvP. I can casually do PvP for probably a year and still be fine. Hey, what's up everybody that's joining the stream? How are you guys doing? I know it's somewhat been a while since I last uh, streamed the mobile games, but we're trying to get back into that. Let's see. I haven't done any of the recent quests. I have so many. I haven't tried. I haven't done any of these. <laughs> 
So we can definitely do some of these today. Um, I guess we'll have to do the Keyblade Challenge today since it... There's only, oh, and High Score Challenge since there's only... Ah, only two days left. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we'll go ahead. We'll go ahead and start those. Gotta just do these. 3,000, 5,000. Okay. And they have reflectors? Ugh. Uh, oh, oh, wait. Oh, come on. Ew. Gross. <coughs> oh, thank you. <coughs> I have to use Treasure Trove. I guess, yeah, this is fine. Woo. Hey, what's up, Gamer Armadius? How are you doing? I'm doing good. <laughs> I feel like everyone's asking me that. Yeah, I'm doing good. I'm kind of just, I'm kind of just chilling at this point, just having fun. Look at that. Let me reposition my face a little bit. There, yeah, there we go. That should be a little bit better. Can you guys come here, all right? By the way, uh, the game's not too loud. It's overdoing. I'm gonna play other stuff too. I'm just starting off with Union Cross. Mm. Do you? No, you don't provide, do you? No, you don't. Do you provide it? No, you don't. Oh, killed it. Just saw some other mobile games in the YouTube thumbnail, so I was just wondering. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm... I haven't downloaded Opera Omni yet. I know a lot of people um, watch my videos and in my Discord and stuff like Opera Omnia, so... I'll probably end up downloading it just to see how it is. Um, at least let you guys enjoy watching me play it, I guess. <laughs> hey, what's up, Keeper? How you doing? Good afternoon. Yeah, I've, I've really started getting into Dragalia Lost, though, lately. It's a, it's a pretty fun game. I'm glad Shai Rooney uh, recommended it to me. I like the, the soundtrack for it, too. It has a very anime feel to it. Like, it feels like it feels like it's almost based off an anime. But when, when it's actually the opposite, it's like, it's just its own game. I feel like they could definitely, like, Nintendo could definitely make an anime off Dragalia Lost if they wanted to, though. It's actually, it honestly doesn't feel that bad. The storyline isn't really that bad either. It feels like something, it just feels like it could be anime. We really like Opera Omnia, probably my favorite mobile game. Doing some inventory management on DDO. Uh, what's DDO? Oh, Dungeons and Dragons Online, gotcha. Gotcha. Almost forgot for a second. Hey, All Might, thank you so much for the follow. Hey, what's up, Smug Pup? How you doing? I know my acronym. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it, it took me a while because I forgot that she, uh, that she and her husband played Dungeon Dragons Online. Edo is still one of my all-time favorite games, even after playing for 10... Jesus Christ, it's been out for that long. I don't. Whew. I think the Brave Frontier is the longest mobile gotcha game that I that I'm aware of. 
I think it's been at what, like five, going on to six years now. Great Frontier. Good, caught some of your Overwatch coaching stream. That was pretty cool. Hey, thanks, appreciate it. Yeah, now that the replay system is finally out in Overwatch, I'll be, I'm gonna be trying to make some a lot more like cinematic uh, gameplay stuff. Be really cool. So like, uh, oh no, did I die? I don't know how much. What's the conditions? No, I'm not gonna waste jewels. Fungus 2006. They just, they just celebrated the 13th anniversary this year. God damn. But yeah, with the Overwatch stuff, anyways, I'm gonna be trying to make a lot like the more cinematic things. So like for example, it'll be like a like at the beginning of games. It'll be, it'll be, I'll, I'll show you like cinematic shots of the map that we're playing on, okay? And then it'll be like an announcer type voice of like, Hello, Overwatch. Welcome to another game with <laughs> between Team Kakashi and Team blah, 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 okay? On the blue hand quarter, we got Team Kakashi. They're going to be going for a blah, blah, blah strat on this map. Their key player is, you know, the, the very announcerish type like um, voiceover. Over the thing, and they'll be like, like as I describe each each player, I'll zoom onto them in their in the spawn room while they're messing around in spawn, um, and then like uh, I'll, I'll like look at defenders as they're setting up and everything, um, and then <laughs> as they start approaching fights, watch them from like an aerial view. Uh, then as the fight starts, starts engaging, I'll like cut to like certain people's perspectives, like their first person perspectives and stuff like that. Um, and like just continuously cutting in and out from like first person perspectives to like third person perspectives as I'm like commenting and discussing like what each team's trying to do and attempt to do and everything like that. It's it's gonna be pretty cool in my opinion. I'm gonna enjoy it. I feel like I would enjoy watching it a whole lot better than uh than what you might call it than watching Overwatch League on Twitch in my opinion uh, because of the fact that even though the commentators on Overwatch League aren't, you know, that bad. At least it gives me some sense of what's happening. It, it just feels like they're just talking about what's happening in the moment and not so much like just like explaining the strategy or whatever is happening. Like, like I, I, ha I find more enjoyment watching coaches um, who like coach the Overwatch team and stuff, explaining their strategies or like, you know, each player's role and everything like that. And then like do doing like a like a, a review of their games um, and like to going at a step by step. Like, so it'll be like something like that, but a little bit more faster paced, like more like a live version of that. Uh, I don't know, I think it would be cool. It'd be a lot of fun. It would feel like really, yeah, exactly. It'd feel like really legit. Anyways. So I'm supposed to beat this. Okay, this should be fine. Let me just swap out some things real quick. And oh, I forgot I got this guy recently. Hell yeah. Give him an attack skill. Uh, six max gauge two. Eight max gauge two. Seven max gauge zero. Do you restore gauges? No, you don't. Seven max gauge one. Seven max gauge zero. Six max gauge zero. We'll give you the seven max gauge one. We'll do that. I don't think I have any trait medals for this guy. Sort by special attack. Yeah, no, I don't have any trait medals for this guy.
Oh, I better hit that EXP farm, my man. Oh, I probably should. Actually, does that consume? Does that consume any uh any AP? Do I have? Is the EXP farm available right now? Zero AP right now? Okay, perfect. Oh yeah, let's do that then. I was like, why are these locked? I forgot it's VIP. You know, I, I started noticing that they, uh, they're doing less and less VIP banners. Okay. Can you close the door? Thank you. Yeah, yeah, this this one. I started noticing they're doing less and less VIP banners. Like, there's no VIP banners in the in the shop right now, which I appreciate. I, f I like the fact that they're finally going back to the traditional five mercy pull format. And it's not the stupid... This oh, this annoying ass, uh, you know, three, three, three metal featured mercy pull thing, where you're like randomly getting a chance at pulling one of these medals instead of like the ones you actually want. Yeah, I was definitely happy about that. For sure. Oh wait, forgot to swap out Merlisha. Where? Get my copy metal. Where'd hell he go? There he is. I haven't been playing much attention. Yeah, I started noticing it recently. Um, again, I started becoming more of a casual player at this point, so it's it's not like I'm like scrutinizing it every single day like I used to. Uh, but it is something I've been noticing, so I, I was definitely happy about that. I heard too that uh, they, they're making it so like we can stack our trait medals now, which is like I knew that was gonna come sooner or later. But it was uh, I may have spent a freaking ton lately on the latest banner. Really, <laughs> one of my party members was telling me that uh, he's he's been saving up like over a hundred k in jewels because there's just nothing worth pulling on uh for a while now which i understand to be to, like i probably could I, don't, I probably wouldn't have 100k but i'd probably have a large amount too uh, for me it's just more the fact that like i'm in that state of mind where I do, i'm just like indifferent i just like don't care i'm just like i don't care anymore i'll just do random pulls here and there just to, just because why not I'm like eh, eh i'm tired of saving constantly i'm just gonna I'm just gonna chuck my jewels here and there. If something big comes along the way, oh well. Not a big deal. Wait, which banner are you talking about, Damo? Damien. real quick that's right I wish I wish I wish they had an auto button that lets the lets your character move around for you to be honest I started becoming a little bit uh spoiled by by Dragalia loss because because Dragalia loss has a feature like that where not only does it increase the speed that stuff happens, but also like actually does the quest for you, <laughs> which at least for me, it just makes sense, you know, considering how many quests and gotcha games like Union Cross there are. I feel the same way, a bit indifferent. Let myself slip below 15k. That fine price that guarantees the supernova. Oh, yeah, I thought that was really nice. That makes sense, Tyrion. I can definitely see that. When I saw that, I was definitely like, yeah, if I had jewels, I'd definitely splurge on this one, too. See, I'm just gonna do something, but I forgot. Oh, delete this.
I'm not sure if I want to stay here and farm EXP medals for too long. I was kind of just planning to do my dailies and then bail, <laughs> and then and then sw swap to another game. I'll probably do one. I'll probably do it one more time for now. By the way, Damien, I, I highly recommend you get into Magic: The Gathering. I remember you popped in one time uh, on my stream when I was playing it, and you said it, it looks complicated or something. I highly recommend you get into it. It's it's really fun. I've been playing it for I don't know, roughly four or five years now. I enjoyed a lot, and it's free to play too. And it's very free to play friendly as well for Magic Arena, uh, Magic Gathering Arena. Like if you easily just do your dailies like every day, you could easily have like top competitive uh, decks fairly easily. Yeah, exa yeah, for sure, Keeper. And the last thing I need in my life right now is more games. Okay, all, all right, I can, I can understand that. <laughs> That's that's le that's a legitimate reason. That's valid. Just to play the game in primary school always looks cool. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. The lore is really good too. Um, man, I don't know how to talk about the lore without like sitting here for a few hours talking about lore, because <laughs> the lore is super in depth. It's it's very uh, immersive. There's there's the word. Said so the same thing. Loaded up on T8, and now it hooked me. Yeah, I know it's hooked Sylvia. Quite a bill too. Last time she popped up in the in the chat. Man, I don't even know what's in PvP right now. Is that all I have left? Oh, I have to do a raid boss. Let me do the raid boss real quick. There it is. I'm always slightly confused when I see people like complain about the fact. Uh, you have any luck getting the five gens? I honestly haven't. I just started. I just started doing events. Like, like I don't know if you saw, but I literally have like not touched like any of the events. <laughs> it just I haven't like I haven't touched the high school challenge. Like nothing. I haven't touched anything. So we're we're doing a couple of them today. Um, at the same time, I've been saving my gems for qu for quite a long time, anyways. That. It's like, for me, if I lose out on some gem, I'm just like, eh. I'm just waiting for the new Keyblade to come out so I can just, like, max it out immediately. Honestly, though, Keeper, I'm actually kind of curious what type of, uh, what colors Damon would like playing if he got into magic. I'm very curious. Fair enough. Run nice Kachans at least once you'll get a bunch of Yeah, yeah, definitely for sure. That's what I'm that's what I was planning to do. I was planning to do at least once today on stream. So at least, you know, can get some rewards. I don't even know what the medals are for the percentages. I'm willing to bet I don't have any of them. Or very little of them. Uh da da da. Rewards. Wait, what are the rewards? That's not it. Rewards, there we go. Holy crap, 30 gems each, my god. I, I just find, I find title so stupid. I wish they would make the uh, the the skills better. Like they're a little too light. At least make it a seven max in my opinion. We're already at nine max, I think. Or are we at ten max? I want to say nine max from what I remember. I think we're at nine max. I think ten came out, but it's not ten max yet. But I feel like these should at least be sevens. Sevens is kind of like the the bottom is like the minimum at this point for a decent attack skill. How much does bottom get? 
So I can... How much do you need for 10? I could be in top 3,500 and get 10 gems each. And some moon gems. Okay. That's that's honestly not too bad. Kinda. I still don't know what the percentage medals are. Guess we'll find out. Um, I got Mickey. I got some of the Heartless. I just got Kiar 20. I barely got any of these. <laughs> I barely got any of these. Come on. Go to Fairy Stars. Take a look real quick, see what I got. Uh, score. I do have trait medals. Yeah, sure, we'll swap this first one. Um... Kind of want to keep the Marluxia for some damage. I don't have these evolved either, so they're not going to do very much. You know what? I'll, I'll keep it like this. Yeah, we'll just keep it like this. Where's Kyrie? I want... I want reverse, I think. Wait, no, you provide max reverse, don't you? Yeah, you do. Okay, I don't have to worry about reverse. We can just do normal, normal Kyrie then. There you are. Oops. There we go. Uh, the skills make zero sense. Yeah, I, I, I don't, I don't understand any meter. Rather take a second chance to or something. Agreed. 65 percent is not too bad. Is this one of them? That's not one of them. Where'd you go? There you are. Actually, what are your... Okay, yeah, 9 max, extra attack, crap ton of strength. My god, the strength value, holy, 32,000, that's insane. What do you have? But you have ground. Oof. Although it has extra attack. Yeah, we'll stick with this one. If you have the tier 4 medals of Zemstar, they count as big percentage. Yeah, I do. I do. That's what I have equipped already. The Illustrated Ventus and Illustrated Aqua A. They're just not involved with Mawows. That's it. Hard to tell what color or combo colors would suit a person. Part of it is also the specific cards too. True. person may enjoy playing a certain color, but if they like a particular card, no matter its color, they can... That's true. Bar Rocks are getting so freaking broken this month. Oh yeah, is there like a booster for him or something? Do I have the boosters? I don't think I have the boosters. What do I have mostly up? Um, we're going power based, I think. Yes, yeah, so we'll go speed. Two hundred percent for all the new. What the? F <laughs> what? Two hundred percent? Jesus Christ! That is kind of broken. No, no, it's, it's got it. I 
I need to start resuming my uh, my Kingdom Hearts 3 Kuroko mode streams and videos. I have like one episode for new game for the for Kuroko mode without my Ultima Keyblade. I need to continue that. I'm still what in Toy Story or something. I didn't want to waste my, my supernovas if I, if I could help it. The game is freaking broken, man. It's tragic. It is super tragic. Like, it's just gotten so stale. Um, I've been having this video in the works that I haven't, like, gotten... I haven't, like, finished yet. Um, that's ultimately going to be talking about, like, the downfall of Union Cross. Um, and just how bad it's gotten. How little... Arguably, literally everything in the game is pointless. Like there's like there's no value in anything you do. My god, this Rox is just going nuts. I have a really good thumbnail for it too. Maybe let me see if I can pop it up. I really like the thumbnail I made for it. I haven't finished the video yet, but really good thumbnail, in my opinion. Uh, add new source. Let's see if I can pop it up. Six thumbnails. Uh, where did I put that? I think I put that in testing. Yep. Okay, so this is what the thumbnail looks like. This is essentially a thumbnail. I think it's really good. It looks pretty cool in my opinion, but it accurately like describes. At least how I feel about it anyways. <laughs> she like that smug pup. <laughs> this had oh, it does provide two fifty percent. Okay, that's good. I'm not sure if I'm going to survive against this guy. Yeah, I'm not going to survive this. It's pretty good, and I definitely agree with you guys, unfortunately. Player cuts are dropping steadily. I don't doubt it. I don't doubt it. I, like, to be honest, I had a feeling that that was the act... Like, um, when I saw that... You know, they're, they're removing the VIP banners and stuff, and they're going back to the five pull mercies and stuff like that. I had a feeling that it was because, like, player the player drops were, uh, player counts were dropping. Finished my big work contract today, so I can finally get back to making videos. Hey! That's good to hear. I had, like... Mm, I don't know. Never mind. I was gonna say something, but I decided not to.
Whew. Well, where am I? Oh wow. Actually, not gonna lie, I made it. I am. I actually made it further than I was expecting. Top four. I'm okay with top four thousand. Honestly, I thought I was gonna get like top ten thousand or something like that. Can finally talk about the player content of video. It's so overdue. Yeah, I've been wondering like when you were gonna talk about that because you you've mentioned that to me what like many months ago when you first brought it up i was ever i was wondering when you when you were gonna start uh like actually cover that um i think there was one more event that expires in one more day or something oh the keyblade challenge this thing in thingamajigger how many things are there there's a lot oh yeah i have to use certain keyblades don't i oh i guess this works out i don't have any yeah, that works out. Is Sicko wants to get to it? Hey, by all means, go for it, man. I've been looking forward to it. Just having time. Just haven't had time. That's the story of my life, Damien. <laughs> the story of my life. There's so many things I want to get to, but I just don't have time because I'm always distracted by something else. Um, kind of like with my second YouTube channel. I've been wanting to, like, actually work on that, like, consistently. Like, as consistently as, like, I have been on this channel. Um, but more so lately on that one, just because I hardly get to make stuff for it. So, that's what I've been doing. Restore Riku? Oh. I'm glad you pulled that, you pointed it out. I completely forgot I had that on here. Crap. All right, well. <laughs> it's cool. I'll just swap it out real quick because I I have to use the same keyblade anyways. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, that's why. I was like, how do I have that equipped? Okay, let me just swap it up real quick. Um, No green, so just power magic. Strength. Let's well, you. We'll do. We'll put Roxas in here. Actually, it's a flying type, right? Okay, no, that's fine. This is this is this is normal. I end up getting distracted by talking to you guys. I, I kind of forget that I'm actually like playing a little bit. <laughs> Time is the biggest cliff for sure, for sure. I definitely agree. It it kinda it kinda sucks too, cause like, if we're not making too much money off YouTube off it just said either, it's like, you, the only motivation really keeping you full, go, like, keeping you going is, like, you know, your passion. And until you can actually make, start, like, decent money off YouTube, where that serves as a motivator, too, to actually consistently work on multiple stuff. Oof. It's so easy to get burnt out. That's kind of what happened to me this last month. Like, I, I was a little burnt out of making you cross stuff. Second days. Fully understand. Yeah. Alright, let's do this. Uh you have two fifty percent, right? Yeah you do.
I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill this guy in time. I don't think I'm doing enough damage. Especially since my copy metal is doing so little damage. Oh, might make it. Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> oh, okay, m maybe I will. Okay, I just barely made it. <laughs> I've barely gotten any new medals this last, what, three months or something? I don't know. Yeah, no, no, d definitely for sure. I I'm starting to see how broken Roxas is for sure. Seems to be the only new medal my party has gotten lately too. I, yeah, I, I definitely agree, Damien. It's kind of what's been turning me off about it as well is that like, even to, like, the events aren't even worth doing. Yet, and at the same time, to even do the events, you have to have, like, the latest medals, which is kind of like, what's the point? Uh, I don't know if I want to do these. Oh, I should do this one after he's the diamond dust. Oh, uh, I don't have very, ugh, I can't do this one. I don't have very good magic medals. Well, I think that's it. Did I get all my... Oh, I haven't done PvP yet. Let me do PvP yet. Let me just get these. How do I have a ranking all of a sudden? I didn't even do... I didn't even do anything on this thing yet. Oh, today's a single. Oh, fantastic. Give more reason for me to, like, not care this week. Come on. Let me just... Let me just quickly... Fix this. Uh, where is it? There you are. Awesome. Now. Do, do, do. Uh, power reverse. Two there. Let's swap up. Actually, let me put. Where's yeah? Let's put you there instead. Um, then magic up right. Ooh. If I, oh wait, wait. I that's right. I got a few more of the the XPs I could put here. Oh, I got a lot more XPs than I thought I was gonna have. Too bad this is not like a double EXP week or anything. We got pretty close. It's actually a lot higher in level than I thought it was going to be. Um, let me grab those. Where is it? I haven't used any of these since that like one event or a month or something. There we go. That should be good for now. It's pretty decent. Hmm. As soon as you open the PV menu, you are ranked at the lowest rank. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. If I'm ranked at a lowest ranked position, what rank is that right now? Twenty six thousand. That's not a lot com compared to like what you think it would be. Oh, it's like, I feel like I'm forgetting about a stronger metal. Where's my Merluxia?
There you are. Uh, da, da, da. Just over 40,000 people played PvP last week. Wow. Wait, what's today? Is today Wednesday? Today is Wednesday. I'm assuming you you can't you you uh check that like at the end of the week, right? The number of people. Cuz normally I would assume the number of people who play PvP goes goes up a little bit more towards the end of the weeks. But 80,000 overall played at least one quest. Yeah, that 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 sounds about right. I like considering the fact that usually about a hundred people, hundred thousand people are like subscribed to the the Twitter account and stuff, um, and some of the numbers you showed me that one time, that sounds fairly fairly similar. Yeah, I'm just gonna let this run. I'm gonna demolish everybody that's down here. I don't even have these supernovas. In the meantime, I'm gonna check some things in the background. Do I still have RuneScape? Uh, no, that's right. I, I turned up. I think I need to reset my emote uh, thing on Discord. Ah, wrong button. This last few months has dipped pretty hard. I'd imagine they're literally not doing anything worth like doing in this game. Uh, someone in my Discord said it spot on, but pretty much this game has just kind of gone downhill ever since they stopped doing the Organization 13 quests. Which feels about right, um, and it's very obvious they're just they're just trying to milk the Kingdom Hearts three game at this point. It fell below 100k just into May and hasn't recovered at all. I'd imagine that makes sense to me. I don't doubt it at all. They're not actively doing anything to try and like keep people incentivized to actually play the game. Like, what makes people play the game in the first place is, like, you know, making it fun. <laughs> and if all you're doing is just monetizing everything you're putting out and not actively trying to keep people there, then it's like, what's the point? I'm always curious about people who are this slow in PvP. They never have any defense skills uh, put in the setup. I feel like they just press optimize and that's it. Which is understandable. Not a lot of people like PvP nearly as much. These are the hot takes we need and deserve. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Hey, what's up, Cyclonic? How are you doing? If, uh, if you're curious, we're about to go into a different game in a few minutes. I'm just wrapping up PvP, completing my dailies real quick, and then I'm going to swap to something else.
The game hardly explains how to build setups, so I think a lot of people just click the button and pray. Yeah, that's that's what I I assumed as well. I had I had uh I had a video, another tutorial video, like halfway finished a while ago, but I never actually went back to finish it. Um, explaining how copies metals work. And then I was going to have others for other reasons too. Like, uh, and like, so like, what was it? I was going to have quite a few videos come out where it was like, uh, understanding the basics and then understanding how copy metals work, which would then lead up to like how to make a proper setup. I had like all these planned out, but never actually like finished them. Partially because of the fact that like, I'm always, I never had time to like finish them because of all like the update videos and stuff and the streams and everything else I was doing. I have like all these super long overdue videos. <laughs> I just like never get the chance to work on for one reason or another. So I recently started FFRK and I am missing friends. Oof. Um, well, if, uh, if you need friend Cyclonic, you can... I haven't played FFRK in a while, so like today we'll assume I get to it today. Uh, today will be like one of the few, t few times I will have logged into it in a, in a good good while, about a month or so. Uh, but I have a channel on my second YouTube channel's Discord. Um, do I have it forever? No, I don't. I think it's on my Cux channel. I swear I have FFRK somewhere. Oh, I do. It is in my Union Cross Discord. Okay, yeah. If you go to my Union Cross Discord, I have a, I have a channel dedicated to FFRK. I was like, I knew I had it somewhere. Um, I have a Dragalia Lost channel, Upper Omnia, FFRK, Breath of Frontier, Doken Battle. I feel like I'm missing one. Oh, I did all of them already. Awesome. Okay, well, those are my dailies. Time to hop on to something else. <laughs> hey, Toxie made magic. Thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. All right, let's move on to something else. <laughs>